What's up, YouTubers? This is uh, Nomass with another YouTube video. Uh, on lunch break right now, and you know, so I won't be able to get enjoy this too much. But my local botanical gardens is uh, holding a lore event where they have a uh, hundreds, hundreds, and hundreds of locations throughout the park, as you can kind of see, just like all over here. Um, just a ton of parts, parts. And if you look at the entrance, there's a whole bunch of lures already turned on. There's two shops right there. You can see I'm in line. Uh, I'm a member here. I come here all the time. Uh, so I'll make a video of this place and see how phenomenal it is. There's a lot of Hitmonchans out here, uh, so it's wonderful. But uh, I'm in line for lunch, so I'll probably spend most of my time at lunch going in this line. But you see I'm right here. The entrance isn't all the way to here. So there's a ton of people here. It started at 12.30. Uh, it's supposed to go on till two, but Botanical Gardens is actually gonna put lures on different ones all the, uh, you know. So basically free lures. And then of course the people that are playing are gonna wanna put lures on too. Uh, it's very, very incredible. I'm gonna actually pull up my camera here uh, so you guys can see, you know, it's no joke. I mean, it is definitely a ton of people in line here. We're getting close here. Let me see if I can zoom in some here. Uh, yeah, I'm just looking using my camera. Uh, I'm not really recording on my camera itself. I'm just using it so you can actually see through the viewfinder. Uh, it's just a lot of traffic here, guys. And uh, we'll see if we can get a little bit closer. We can actually see the curb here while we're turning into the botanical gardens here. And you can see it's just so many people here. And it's a beautiful garden. So every once in a while, I'll come in through the camera if I'm actually gonna have time to go in here didn't do anything like I said I'm on lunch break uh, luckily I'm able to take a little bit longer lunch than usual uh, but you know definitely gonna make my day a lot harder when I get back but that's okay so we're gonna see what we can find while we're here guys I'm not gonna stay on too long for the video itself because I am meeting a friend in here and I don't really think she wants to be on a YouTube video or be and of course, you, I don't want to walk around the park with my headset on when there's so many people here that you can meet. Um, I'm gonna go back to the camera so you can see, you know, we're getting close, guys, we really are. Um, you know, it sucks that I'm not with my friend right now because I got to pay for the entrance fee since she has the uh, Botanical Gardens Pass, um, but that's okay. And you know, it's shocking, you know, uh, I haven't seen any Pokemon pop up yet. Um, so that's interesting. So obviously these two lures here would have already, uh, what is a Pidgey? But the lures were on earlier. Uh, so I'm assuming they, uh, they put it on at 12 o'clock when they said this, this thing starts. Um, so, you know, hopefully out of this, I'll actually get a couple of berries because I'm out of berries. Um, last night in that spot I talked about last video, I uh, caught a Hitmonlee which is awesome uh, but I missed an Arcanine and a Dragonair and the Arcane one nine oh I got an egg guys uh, the Arcanine was over a thousand so uh, last we talked my Pokedex on them was like 70 something it's at 91 I was perfect until I missed that stinking Arcanine and I also missed that stinking Dragonair which you know turns into my favorite Dragon Knight but yeah I missed them because I had no berries. How many berries are we looking at right now? And there again, I have no berries. And a sparrow. I don't need them, but I'll take this, the dust, the star dust, you know, to help evolve. These guys are pretty strong too, 280, 288. It might be because of my level being so high. Um, but he's probably gonna run, but I'm not gonna waste any uh, great balls or ultra balls on him or any berries because I don't have any first of all but I'm not gonna waste anything on them and if I don't catch them soon I'm gonna get out of them because I need to get this shot that's right here hopefully he'll run or I catch him on this one there we go all right all right I'll worry about sending him to Professor Oak later or Professor whoever in this game all right, so we're getting closer into the gardens and you can see, look at all them shops, guys. Look at all them shops. There's not one lore on, so that's a little disappointing. So I wonder if the lures are gonna be further out. But look at all them shops. I'm gonna actually go to a live stream on the video camera again. 
I mean, you can see there's a ton of traffic still trying to head in. But I mean, it's very beautiful here. It's, I mean, just the plants, the animals. I mean, it's wonderful. Uh, I come all the time, take pictures and stuff. Maybe I'll start posting those or something. I don't know. But uh, we'll see what we got, guys. Uh, for now, I mean, we don't really have any more shops, so we're just kind of sitting here waiting. But if I zoom out, I can see in the shop, the store, you can see, look at all them leaves kicking up. Uh, nearby radar kind of sucks, but if you look, man, there's so many guys in there. And it's neat because it's each shop is a little token of something, you know, holly grape plaque. So it's like a plaque of some of the more impressive plants in here. Some of them are, you know, donation things. Sorry if my AC guys are, you know, blowing you guys up and everything. But, I mean, it's just a ton of stuff in here. A ton of stuff. But I don't see any lures. I mean, how is this a lure party and there's no lures in the beginning? It's kind of disappointing. If I didn't have a friend in there, I probably would turn around at this point and just come another day. Because I'm already 20 minutes into my lunch break and... I haven't even made it inside yet. There's a side duck on the board though. By the way guys, uh, since last time, uh, let's take a look. You know, caught a good amount of Pokemon. Uh, but uh, got another Flareon at a high level. Got a Gold Duck here, a Star Me, and a Jolteon at a high level. Um, so, good amount of Pokemon. You know, slowly but surely getting some. Uh, I was reading some research into this ditto theory, guys. Uh, I'm gonna probably make a ditto video because um, I have a theory of my own. Uh, apparently, ditto is an Easter egg in the game uh, that he's, you know, you can't catch him, but he's an Easter egg. So I have a couple different theories about that. Um, so if you're interested in that, you know, put a like, let me know, and uh, I'll talk about those in more detail. Um, but for now, guys, since uh. I'm still just sitting here. It might be a boring video, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video for now because, like I said, it's just sitting here, and then uh, I'll be back. Hey guys, a Vortor popped up. Let me mute my music here. Sorry about that, guys. A Vortor. Hopefully, this guy's not too hard because uh, I don't have any berries, but I do need them. I don't have that many Vortorb candies, so we'll see what happens, guys. Hot dog. All right, guys, so I'm, I'm pausing it every once in a while um, while I'm here. Yeah, I don't know how what level, you know, my other Voltorbs are, but 281's not too bad. All right, guys, I'll be back here if anything else pops up and or until I get in the park. Okay, guys, I'm back for a moment. Uh, good thing about slow moving traffic is eggs. My eggs cracking. Sorry, I'm trying to eat a little bit of lunch. A Bulbasaur! Awesome! I need another one. I need all that candy. Seven pieces of candy, and he's $5.91. I am excited about that, guys. Really excited about that. Part of my ditto theory has to do with Bulbasaur. So. Maybe I'll make a video about it. And maybe I'll use this one. Awesome. So excited. All right, guys. So I'm going back so I can eat some more lunch so you guys don't hear me chewing and smacking and all whatever I do when I eat. So I'll be right back. Back for a second, guys. We're getting closer. Much, much closer. Let me show you real quick the camera. I mean, there's just a lot of people still here, guys. Just a lot of people. Starting to see the entrance now. Uh, but also when I came on, excuse me, it was a side duck. It's a 99 side duck, uh, it's not too strong, but side duck's okay to catch. Always can use the candy to help my gold duck or maybe get a stronger side duck and evolve him. All right, that was pretty easy guys. You know what? While I got time, I'm going to transfer him out. Don't need him cluttering up my Pokemon. Alright guys, oh, see we're starting to see some lures put out over there on this little strip here. Um, but we're getting closer. A little closer. 
be back on in a little bit, guys. All right, guys, so uh, we're getting closer, much closer, not too much. I just hit that shop there, got a berry and a, I believe a Pokeball or two. Um, I think it was a great ball, but you can see uh, we're very close here. Uh, unfortunately, I had to pay still. I tried to you know, talk my way in since I'm a member, but since I don't have my card and my family's already in, I guess I have to pay just for about 20 minutes of uh, gameplay because I gotta get back to work. You know, it sucks when you have to work on weekends, but that's okay. All right, so um, my friend or uh, family that's in the shop called me while I was you know, waiting to get in. And apparently they somehow replaced Hitmonchant, which used to be in abundance here, with the Voltorbs. Um, Cause I've never really seen that many Voltorbs here, but Apparently that's what somehow that happened. I don't really know how that happened. If anybody has any information about that, comment below. But really, I'm, I'm a little disappointed with that. I was really looking forward to getting another Hitmonchan, hopefully at a higher level. All right, guys, I'm gonna pay this guy here in a few minutes to get checked in and then uh, see what we got. All right, guys, we're in. As you can see, we're moving a little bit faster here. <clears throat> Grab some of these shops. We're gonna I got another egg, guys. Got an egg. All right, so um, we're gonna go in, and uh, you can see there's plenty of lures out now. As we're getting closer into the park, gyms are changing colors. You know, fighting. It's wonderful. Team Yellow, uh, which is I can't remember what that is called. Mystique, I think. You know, sad I don't know the team colors. Oh, look at that, guys! A Flareon. I'm gonna leave them be though, only because I only have a short time here, and I want to hit these shops because uh, that's what I'm really here for is to get berries. Now, eggs aren't bad either. Don't mind eggs, but definitely want some berries. And yeah, Team Instinct actually is yellow. Should know my own team color at least, but you know, no one I know is Team Instinct. Everybody I know is, you know, one of the other two. So. But anyhow, so we got a lure coming up here, guys, on the left. Like I said, I'm not hanging out at any of these. I'm just trying to get over here to this parking. My friend mm. should be, there's a rat attack, guys. My friend, she should be somewhere around here. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and hit the shop here. Uh, baboon. I got a berry, guys. We got a berry. That's what we're here for. Mm. Um. So we can see what that is. A Weedle. Nah, I don't care about Weedles. But if you notice, there's no Hitmon chance. So she was right. It's all Voltorbs that were not here before. I don't know why they got rid of the Hitmon chance and changed it, but that kind of makes me upset a little, but it also makes me feel pretty, pretty good because if they're changing it from Hitmon chance to Voltorb, then maybe they'll change it again from Voltorb to something else. You know, maybe. And that could be good. Because that means more variety of Pokemon. Um, Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, see if I can drive around here to the back. And Guys, I've never seen this park so busy. Uh, I mean, just I've never seen this park so busy. There's just so many cars here. This parking lot is huge. And it's never this busy. I mean, literally never this busy. Uh, but let's go ahead and get a spot here doesn't really matter exactly because I only have such a short time but we're gonna run in and see what we can find and see if we can uh but look at this we got a tram usually the tram goes through and shows everybody about the park and the interesting things of the park but a lot of people use it now for Pokemon going you know so they don't have to walk pretty sad but all right gonna go back to the game here and see what we can get all right so I've got roughly about 45 minutes um, I'm gonna pause the video for a minute, guys. Uh, make a phone call, see if I can find out where she's located. Uh, and I'll be back, guys. Uh, just bear with me, guys. Uh, all right, guys. Oh, got an egg hatching. So there's a lot of people here, so be, and I'm by myself. So people are gonna think I'm crazy talking to myself, but uh, that's all right. 
you guys know who I'm talking to. Oh, I got a Meowth. That's cool. What kind of eggs did I get? I got 12 candies. 304 Meowth. Strongest one I've gotten. Oh, got another one here, guys. Uh, let's see. Good thing about waiting in that long line, I guess. Oh, yes. I accidentally used 25 candies last night and evolved one. And I got 21 back. So, kind of brought me back to where I was, but... Really, I could be evolving into a Nidal King or Nidal Queen, but oh well. Oh, we got another one. What do we got? Sand Shrew. That's okay. Alright. Alright, guys. All right, guys, first time I've seen a polywhirl in public. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's see if I can catch them. Sorry, I had to make sure I was recording. Uh, he might run. Let's go ahead and give this guy a great ball real quick. Oh, I would up if I actually throw it all the way to him. And there goes the game with the curve. He punched it, guys. I can't throw the great balls on. Let's go live and see if that helps. All right. All right. Game is laggy really bad right now, guys. Oh, I hit him, but he punched it. See if that caught him. Dang, he's broke out, guys. He punched it again. Really want to catch him, so I'm going to use an ultra ball. I wasted all the great balls, though. They didn't even hit him. That was a waste of an ultra ball. That's two ultra balls. I'm not going to do this anymore, guys. Got a nice toss. Let's see what happens. Got him. Awesome. See how many candies that gives me too. I got three of course from him, but gave me 63. Almost enough to evolve him, but I'm not going to evolve him. I got a stronger one. Alright, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video. I see my friend. I'm going to pause the video. I'll be back, guys. Guys, there's a Volt Torb right here overneath the fence here. And uh, my friend, I'm not going to really show her in the video, but she's got a live dragonfly Pokemon on her foot. But anyway. Guys, we're catching that Volt Torb. And he's broke free. Alright, I'm going to work on catching him. I think the video is kind of making it lag, so I'm going to pause for now. I'll be back, guys. Guys, I'm gonna end the video. The game is lagging with this video with so many people playing. So, till next time, see you later.